good morning from the one and only Bush Gardens. We're in Tampa this morning. I am here with my lovely mother, who probably won't want to be on camera, but we'll see. And we are here to look at the animals. We're having an animal day today. Um, why? Because my mother does not do rides at all. So we're going to enjoy our day, see what we can find for some cool animals, uh, go on some of the excursions, and yeah, we'll record it for you. Let's go check it out. Are the largest reptile in North America, growing up to 15 feet long and a thousand pounds. Let's go see if we can find any apes today, gorillas. There they are. Oh. This one's just sunning himself or herself. Loving life. I guess we're getting closer to gorilla country. This area is very nice. Oh. <laughs> Someone's getting some sweet, sweet love right now. Oh. That big guy going. I feel like he's gonna sneak up and. Oh, oh, oh! Okay, we think there needs to be some explanation with that previous video. We kind of figured out that. The two that were on, one was on top of the other. They're young, uh, like children, teenagers. They were playing in roughhousing. The one that went to go break it up looks like mama. And she was not messing around because <laughs> they knew as soon as she came over, they'd quit the, the naughtiness. So it wasn't exactly what we thought when we first walked up, but it was really funny anyway. I forget what kind of penguins these are, but they're essentially like warm water. Oh, they love the bubbles. Hi, guys. Oh, my gosh. I never see them this active. They love those bubbles. African penguins. Yeah, they are warm water. It looks like they're in some sort of state of conservation, I guess. Now we're over near the, I think it's the Nairobi train station, and we're going to walk Animal Connections. That's a green iguana. Oh, here he is. Look at that big old mug. An American alligator. Oh, look. Some little guys. Despite their bulky body shape, rock hyraxes move with great agility among rocks and ledges across Africa. Oh, look at this little guy. These smaller ones, the babies, are just starting to turn like a lovely shade of pink. But these bad boys right here, they are so pink they're almost like orange, like coral color. They're big too. This sloth is tired. Look, he's holding on to the branch. That handsome devil is a gray-crowned crane. Quit grooming himself and look at us. Hey there, buddy. He's handsome. It's hard. The shade does not do these birds justice because they are bright and beautiful. Hi, buddy. Hello. It's getting closer. Can we see you? Oh, yeah. It's a screaming, hairy armadillo. And 
I don't know if we'll find out exactly what a hairy armadillo looks like today, but he looks like he's having fun in there. This is an eastern coral snake, and let me see if I can zoom in on him. Do you see him right there? I swear he's the devil. And then a scarlet king snake. This king snake is the same colors, but like in a different pattern. I hate snakes. An eyelash palm pit viper. Holy cannoli. You terrible viper, you. Oh my God, I got the heebie-jeebies. Oh, look at his little gross pinhead. Look at me trash talking a viper. A dusky pygmy rattlesnake. This one's a pygmy. They have these down where you are too. This is, you said the Eastern Diamondback. Those are his rattles right here. I know it's real hard to see. Let me see if I go in a little bit more, if it'll hide the glare. No, it's worse. That's okay. That's a little better. There he is. There's the Chinese crocodile lizard native to Southern China and Northern Vietnam. So this little beauty is an Angolian python. There's his face. And then this guy here, he actually has a really cool name. It's hard to see him because he's hiding in the tunnel, but it's a Brazilian rainbow boa. These frogs are fancy. They're different uh, dart frogs. The green and black, this little guy right here, I guess he's poison. And then there's some blue ones. And then look at these ones. They're half like yellow, half blue. <laughs> look everybody, that's where Santa's house is. I bet you didn't know that. It's right here at Bush Gardens. Check out this big guy. These are Aldabra tortoise. They can easily live over a hundred years. It's not unusual for the males of this species to grow over four feet in length and weigh over 550 pounds and they're from Africa. So this is the 2022 event series. So January 4th through the 27th is real music series. Uh, Mardi Gras has started as well. That's January 8th through March 6th. Then at the end of January into February 13th is the Bush Gardens uh, Sesame Street Kids Weekend. March 11th through May 22nd is the Food and Wine Festival. Very good then Cinco de Mayo and lots of other things. That's basically the whole year in a snapshot. So we're here on Wednesday, January 19. And when I say it is dead, I mean, you don't have to worry about feeling like you're in a tight and close space around here because um, there's hardly anybody here. It's wonderful. It kind of, it's nice because we've been going to Disney so often and there really has not been a downtime for Disney at all. So this is a really nice change. I feel like relaxed. I see some elephants. Let's go get a closer look. think are gonna make our way over and uh, get to that box right there that he's actually sitting on and uh, see if we can see him from underneath you can actually see somebody in there right now oh look if they were in the water you could go down below and take a peek at them if they were actually in the water So now we're in the orangutan output and the cool thing about this place is it's hard to see because it's so bright there's hammocks here oh there's no orangutans normally you can find them hanging out you can literally stand on top of them oh there they are 
kind of cuddled up there. There they are. There he is. Look at him. There he goes. Just for chilling. So far, as long as I've been back at Bush Gardens, which is like the last year, um, the Sky Ride, which is a gondola system that goes from front to back or back to front, has not been working. But this sign came out at Christmas time that it's going to be opening up again summer of 2022. I'm really excited. There's so much going on in Stanley Falls. There's the log flume over here. You can see the new roller coaster off in the distance, which we'll get closer to that. You'll see it closer. And then this is Shikra. And I can hear Tigris behind me. It's hard to see right now. I'll, I'll try and get a closer video. We just got to Tigris and the wait time for Tigris is 10 minutes. This is a great vantage point to see Tigris. Give it a second, you'll see it come up to the top. Ugh. I think I would drop dead of a heart attack, to be honest. Nope, can't do it. Hi. Normally they give you nectar. Look at the parrot um, to feed the birds, but I didn't, he wasn't passing it out. Thank you. Oh, look at you. Hi, sweet thing. Guys, if you don't mind just moving down the path for me, please have some more people coming in. You have to look for them because they like to hide down here. See if I can, there they are. Roseate spoonbill. How do you know that? Because we have the tons of them where we are. Do you? Yeah. Look how cute he is. Hello. You're so handsome. It's like a dangerous murder duck. It's going to peck my mother's eyes out. Mostly my mom because she's mouthy like that. Look how gorgeous these handsome devils are. What's this kind of bird? Is that a goose? A type of goose? They're just hanging out. Oh, look, back here. In the back, back here, I'll zoom in. Oh, I missed him hopping. You can see there's not just one right here. There's another one hiding right there. Is she nesting? Hey girl, hey. There's the other black swan. I knew there was two. I think we missed a couple, but we still had a really full day. I'll be back to experience Mardi Gras and to, and I'll let you know what that's like. And if you are considering, if you want to do rides and you can get out here on a weekday, now's the time to do it. Pretty much all the rides were 10 minutes or less. <laughs> oh, that's the first time my mom's been here since I was in the seventh grade. I think she had a good time. Yeah, we had a wonderful day. I hope you have a good day today and a better day tomorrow, and I will see you very soon. Bye.